Mambo. Hi there. It's the life link. Aldo Zang here. We are in this graph, Impa. And this is basically the plan of vision using Blend VR. That's what I'd like to showcase here. Uh, what I have here is this uh, desk. Okay, let me go here. It's simply a desk with a projector projecting from above, from above which is a stereo projector. That's why, that's why I get some ghosting. And I have some tracking going on here, in this case with the cap. So, put it here under the light, you see the cap. If I move the cap, the, the head position in the scene moves accordingly. And the nice thing is, if I move the cap with the camera, or rather, the camera with the cap, you get to see, you see that the, the scene itself is changing. So, you see the monkey. Now you get to see the back side of the monkey. Can go very close, can go very, very far. And the other thing I'd like to show just quickly is that I don't know if you can see this in the video. Uh, maybe you can. Anyway, this is one of these uh, active shutting classes. So each eye gets a different image. And yeah. Just to illustrate the what happens with the tracking. See what level. So now we're gonna stay put while the while all the moves around with the cap. So from our point of view, and you know, might even rotate, everything gets very distorted. Although uh it's a fashion book in my Tipo, bem mais para ficar aquela distorção, super distorção. And this is similar with... Um, this is the same principle as Cave. Or if you see these artists on the street doing these so-called 3D drawings, when, when it gets you from one point of view, you get a correct perspective. Uh, just the difference here between this system and a Cave is that in the Cave, the head orientation is taken into account to calculate the, the matrices, the open gel matrices. While in this case, uh, we assume, I give the campaign? We assume we are always looking at the, at, uh, at the screen, uh, at the table. So otherwise, if you're actually taking the head into consideration, when you're going from one side to the other side of the table, you'd have to flip the stereo glasses to get the correct stereo perspective feeling. So this way, always, if you always consider that you're looking to that way for the calculations, the left eye is always, is always here, while the right eye would always be here. And that's pretty much about it. Uh, we are it's just to showcase a very basic User usage of the Blender Work frame framework here at Impa. Bye.